welcome back to the channel. Today is wheel day, finally, after a seven month back order, the uh, Venom Rex wheels showed up. Um, hopefully they're as cool as they look on the internet, because uh, that was a long wait for some wheels. But uh, we're gonna do an unboxing here for you, um, show you the wheel, and then uh, we'll get them mounted up and show you the results. All right, guys, the reveal. nice little cover on them so we have to take some more stuff off before we can see that beautiful wheel <clears throat> there she is I think those are going to look pretty cool on the cactus gray guys. Pretty cool. All right. Well, let's see what's in the next box. Should be some uh, lug nuts. <clears throat> That's what I ordered the black lug nuts. black lugs to go with so I think we should go get them mounted up stay tuned all right guys here it is wheels are mounted on the tires those are the uh, 35 inch territory MT Goodyear's same ones that come on the Sasquatch package um, we didn't uh, do any tire upgrades because uh, we already spent enough on those tires. Once these wears out, maybe, maybe we'll go with like some ridge grapplers because uh, those look pretty mean on there. But uh, for now, we'll just use those 35s. But what do you guys think? I think they turned out pretty awesome with that uh, bronze color on the cactus gray. I think they really look good. Leave a comment down below what you guys think. Was it worth waiting seven months? I think it was. So I really, really dig this wheel. The design, I like the spokes. But uh, the uh, offset on these is a zero offset. So we definitely have some poke. Um, I measured it, it uh, all the way out to right here on the edge of the tire. It's three inches out from the uh, stock um, fender flares. Um, and at first I thought maybe I was going to get the uh, Sasquatch fender flares, but uh, I think I'm going to leave them. I like the way it uh, it looks with the, uh, the stock fender flares. Um, let me know what you guys think. Should we go with the uh, Sasquatch flares or leave it like this? I think it looks, I think it looks better with the little poke. Tops off for the summer, looking clean. If uh, it's the first time you guys are uh, checking out the channel, um, this is a zone two inch lift on this. Um, just the uh, pucks that go on top of the tower, shock towers. So just the two inch and it levels it off in the front with the zone. So it's completely level front to back. Some of them I know still has the rake in the front and I don't like that. So two inches as big as we could go right now and still get it in my garage. Um, we have a really low six and a half foot garage door so if we decide to to go bigger so i would really like to do some 37s and maybe a three and a half inch lift but then i'd have to keep it down at my storage garage it wouldn't be convenient so for now that's as big as we can go but uh yeah guys i think it turned out great um if you guys are interested in some uh, Venom Rex wheels, I'll have the links down in the description. You can take a peek at them. I know as of this video, they still had some in stock, but I know they probably won't last long and then you'll be on a wait list like I was for seven months. So thanks for tuning in again, guys. Stay tuned for the next video we got coming up here. 
Um, we'll have a uh, drive review on the new uh, GT350R we picked up and a couple other videos coming up. So please uh, subscribe if you haven't and have a good one.